Have Good. you seen or read JoJo? I have. I watched the JoJo ones up to uh, the last one on Netflix. Part so six, yeah. I guess yeah. part six, like Florida Damn, Prison. Yeah. Yeah. I saw some of the Florida Prison one. Um, I haven't finished it yet, though. Yeah. Um, but yeah, no, I've. I, Do you fuck with it? Yeah, no, I love JoJo. Yeah. It's yeah. weird as fuck. Um, <laughs> I have a bad take, according to Connor. I tell people not to watch part one. Yeah, that's a no, bad take. No, you don't do that. No. That's a bad take. Yeah. Yeah. We, don't, we, don't don't skip parts. we don't skip parts there. We don't skip parts there. I'm just saying, I, well, like, I'll tell people, like, it's a little... I mean, it's very different. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Show. Yeah. It's like a different show that they made <laughs> yeah. for some reason. Obviously, there's backbone there, you know, like the food and yeah. <laughs> you know, the speed wagon, or not Purunarafu, but the speed wagon. Speed wagon. Yeah. Speed wagon. And, yeah. and, you know, everyone else, like the whole family lineage is established there. But like, other than that, it's like a different anime. Yeah. Yeah, but it's nice. You get, a, you get, you get like rewarded for watching. And I feel like you could appreciate the show more yeah. uh, for wildly changing it up, but then also having little crumbs that kind of like reward yeah, you. Yeah, especially like when you get to parts. like the later, later parts, like yeah. seven and eight, yeah. where it's where it actually they start to call back to stuff in part one. It's like, oh, okay, if it's I worth it. part six, you know, and, and they're doing all this weird fucking shit that makes no sense already because they don't explain stands ever. Yeah. After. yeah. Cause like, why would they? Cause you've, you've watched part three. Yeah. Right? yeah. And then they're like, oh, and then we're gonna get the, we're gonna get the stand to the Speedwagon Foundation. It's like, what does any of these yeah. words mean? <laughs> yeah, no. You it, have to watch. That's what I mean though like you just establish him as a character and like but then after that it's Nothing. like it just yeah. drops you into this world where yeah. like oh the fighting sequences changed completely like <laughs> yeah. that's cool i guess yeah i mean i really like it because i it's like even though part one is my least favorite part it's kind of like a timestamp of the era that it was made in right you know mm. it's, it's very reminiscent of the og 80s action movies yep. everyone's like overly buff and everyone's like a oh, giga chad. Yeah. I love yeah, that slowly shit. get less giga chad over. Yeah, 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 yeah. I mean, I like it though. I, I like that it's, they're all evolving. Yeah, yeah. for sure. Yeah, uh, which, whereas, which one's your favorite part? Ooh. My favorite is Cujo. So I probably like- Part six? Part, is, is that part six? Well, oh no, sorry, Cujo. Cujo well, Joe Cujo. Joe Taro's part Cujo, three. Cujo. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So oh, like okay, yeah. Kira and all of that. That's part, four. That's part, four. <laughs> that part four. Yeah. Well, yeah. Jojo is in part four as well. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. So, so the Joe Ske, right? With the pompadour? Yeah, yeah. yeah, that's yeah part okay. four. Oh, no, 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 no. Not Joe Ske. No, no, no. The, with the hat. Joe Taro. Yeah, yeah, that's, that's part, three. part three. He's in part three, four, and yeah. six. And six. Yeah. 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 But you just like him. As a I just like him. He's my favorite. Okay. Character. <laughs> he, is, he is the most popular. Yeah. yeah. Uh, okay. After, that makes sense. But I think in Japan, Dio is the most popular character. Really? Yeah. yeah well, he, he's Dio. probably like the biggest reoccurring character outside of Yeah, he turns Jotaro. up in everything. Japan loves yeah. the bad boys, man. Yeah, they yeah. do, they do. That's, actually, that's surprising. <laughs> but that's, just, Cause he's like a, cause he's like super charismatic and crazy. Mm -hmm. He's like what? psychotic. Yeah. They, yeah. Japan loves psychotic characters. What, like, why would you root for the bad guy? That makes no sense. What? No, cause he's <laughs> epic. I love him. What the fuck? Cause he's great. He's just <laughs> that's got a odd. stage presence, you know? And the, the Japanese voices are so goddamn good as yeah. well. Mm. Uh, it's so fucking good. Yeah, I think it's just just because he is, you know, Japan being like a very, let's say, a very quiet society. They love someone who's like more eccentric. Yeah. Shows who themselves we'd be more. like that's dumb. We'd yeah. be like that's fucking annoying. <laughs> uh, like, <laughs> you know what my first experience with JoJo was? It was the fucking Steam sale edits where they would. Have you seen these? When they oh, would do like, yeah, yeah, it was yeah. like a, they would have these meme edits where it was like a steam, when back when steam sale, steam sale was a big meme. Yeah. So obviously it's always, everything's dirt cheap. Yeah. yeah. And they would do like the final fight in part three. Yeah. With Dio versus Jotaro. And it would just be like, because he screams Muda so many times. Yeah. yeah. Just like throwing more steam sale memes <laughs> at like another sale, oh, yeah. another yeah, sale. Yeah. That's the first time you ever saw Jojo? It was the first time I was ever interacted. It's a meme. And I just didn't understand. That's how Connor discovers most things. Yeah. Yeah. Well, cause it was like, memes. I was like, what the fuck is this? And then there's this Dude screaming and there's and Jotaro is like the wallet and Dio is like the money. Like the guy taking the like steams taking yeah. the money. I have no idea how I got into JoJo. Yeah, how did you? I don't know. I literally <laughs> have no because it's like it's like one of those things where it's so popular and it yeah. has like an annoying fan base. Super yeah. Annoying. yeah. So then like kind of like One Piece, as a matter of fact, I would <laughs> yeah. say. Is that is that how you, is that how you get into anime? You just like you get annoyed. I get bullied into you it. You get bullied into <laughs> watching yeah. it. No, no, no. I, I don't think JoJo was like, you have to watch this, like um, but it just, I don't know. Well, yeah, cause Jojo fans have like the reputation of being the annoying fan base. Oh like, yeah. Like, never being yeah. able to shut up about the show. Yeah. Which is totally true by the way. But that's oh, like, yeah. like every, that. I feel like there's every anime fan base. One Piece love to pretend they're not like that, but One Piece fans oh are like Oh my God, oh, like One Piece is way worse. I <laughs> yeah. promise you, like as someone who watched Jojo and is currently watching One Piece, yeah. One Piece was way worse <laughs> with respect to like how much they were like, bro, you have to watch One Piece. And it's <laughs> such a, 
it's like a biblical text. Like it's, so, <laughs> it's too many episodes. So you're like, I don't have that kind of time. Like commitment. Uh, we're talking, I'm on the New yeah. Testament. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. It's like I don't have that kind of time commitment. Like I can't do this. This is, and then and then you get into it, and you're like, oh my god, it's so good. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yes, it's, we did it once. Yeah. It's, it's the OG cult in Japan. Yeah. Like oh it's, yeah. It's like the most popular cult. Yeah. I have people now in my fan base that just like don't know me for politics, but just like listen to me talk about One Piece because like. There's a, I have a thousands of fan channels on yeah, YouTube, right, right. right? Like I don't have any IP or anything. So I'm like, whatever, you know, let it ride. Who cares? Yeah. yeah. There's this one fan channel that made an edit um, about how I like used to talk shit about One Piece and I started watching it. Oh, yeah. <laughs> and those videos independently, this channel's got like 10K subs or something, like nothing crazy. Yeah. That video got like 100,000 views <laughs> on its own. And now he's just like detailing and documenting every single episode and every single arc that I like summarize basically right. as I'm watching it. And like, there is a fan base for that. Yeah, oh yeah. Love One Piece. And yeah. Obsessed yeah. Obsessed with everything. Um, which is a very political anime, Connor. That's uh, okay. Well, <laughs> it is a very political <laughs> what? anime. He told me One Piece is very political. Yes. It, what aspect? <laughs> oh my God. Yes. I love this. Okay. <laughs> okay, okay, this is going to piss off everybody, but I'm so right about this, even though like, I'm, <laughs> no, okay. like, okay. First of all, every single arc, well, other than like the first couple of arcs, mm. every single arc quite literally details like leftist politics, which I think Oda is. <laughs> Oda is 100%. Oda is 100% a leftist, first of all. <laughs> He has, che he has a Che Guevara photo in his studio. 100% look it up. Establish fact. I have assets. <laughs> I can pull it up. I got the receipts. Show, I want to see this. I can pull this up. Okay, right. hold on. All right, okay. What else, what else, what else? Okay, that? so that's number one. Yeah, number okay. two, which arc are you on? I don't want to like spoil anything. He's uh, uh, I just finished, uh, yeah, I just Thriller Bark. Thriller uh, Bark. Uh, Water 7. Yeah. Okay. Um, so Thriller Bark kind of sucks. I'm sorry to hear that. That's yeah, like, yeah, the ending is great, but like everything yeah. else is kind of mid. Yeah. But it's fine because yeah. what comes after is <sighs> so good. Everyone says this. Okay. He's so right. He's right, though. It's so right. good. It's He's so, right. good. It's so Hold fucking up, let good. Hold up, um, let him cook. So, let him cook. Let him cook. That means you watch like, you watch Alabaster, right? Yeah. Which is definitely political, but like not as aggressively, but it's about like resource deprivation, things like that. Mm -hmm. But then Skypea, which again, maybe a little bit too long as mm -hmm. an arc, is quite literally about like, you know, indigenous uh, populations being removed from their land mm. and like violently trying to, 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 uh, you know, find autonomy and emancipation through, you know, through violent means directly against like right. an enemy that is much more powerful than them. Right. That is like, you know, that's a, like a land back movement, which is inherently very political, very leftist. Um, <laughs> I feel like I watched a different, I read a different Yeah, I know. I, I was trying to describe this to him. He's like, what are you talking about? It's I was about- like, man, I saw funny gum man. Yeah, uh, yeah. yeah. No, One guy. Piece is about having fun with your friends and being free. <laughs> yeah, what? exactly. I mean, first of all, Luffy is a terrorist. <laughs> Yeah, he is. He is. I mean, I mean, he literally is. I he's, mean, he's I, fighting. I, I, I hate that you're kind of right. Yes, I fucking he, hate that you're kind of wow. right. Yeah, he is a freedom fighter yeah. in the in the most like honorable sense of the word. Yeah. He is quite literally fighting against an unjustifiable, corrupt military apparatus that is like holding the entire world <laughs> hostage the world government and yeah. the navy he's literally killing cops like <laughs> like he's killing sea cops and motherfuckers are like no 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 that's not politics what do you mean that's just like gum man having yeah. fun I'm, I'm, i mean the thing is like i remember you saying this yesterday when we were having dinner and i was just like um i i mean i th i think with One Piece, just because of the art style and just yeah. the way things are, haha, <laughs> funny rubber man. Yeah. Of course, you know, you can you can take it at that level and it's still very, very interesting stories. But if you break down some of the stuff that happens, half of it is uh, Luffy going up against a corrupt government or corrupt- Yeah. Like, I mean like- Bro, you, you, you need to start an anime analysis channel. Like, <laughs> yeah, I, no, would, I would legitimately <laughs> watch like Luffy, a 15 minute breakdown Luffy of this. Luffy is a leftist. And yeah. yeah. No, why but it's Luffy like, would play oh. Hogwarts Legacy? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, um, it's, uh, I'm not even, well, there's like, there's a, there's trans representation in that too, but we're not going to get into that right now. Yeah. But um, as far as like uh, Oda goes, I mean, here, there is the, uh, I think like dragons, does, I mean, I don't want to like spoil anything, but yeah. um, Oda, Oda has talked about how dragon's design was inspired in part by revolutionaries like Fidel Castro. Yeah. He has a Che Guevara photo in his, in his uh, office. I, I mean, believe, okay. Okay. I, I don't know this part yet. I'm not at that part yet, so I can't speak on this, right. but uh. I think dragon's ship is literally the same name as Fidel Castro's ship. Okay, but here's the thing, here's the thing. Um, 
I think sometimes, you know, especially when you see this a lot in Japanese manga, sometimes authors will put shit in there just because it looks cool. Oh right? yeah. Right? Sometimes it's they're, they're, it's it's like, you know, the curtain is blue kind of like argument. Sometimes mm. you look at something and it's yeah. a reference to uh, some Western media or Western history. And a lot of the times it's just, Japanese people find Western things that uh, find Western no, things no. cool. It's you know? too many. It, the, <laughs> it's too many coincidences. The, listen, listen, listen. The Bolivarian Revolution in Cuba <laughs> was conducted with a yacht that was used to transport eighty-two fighters of the Cuban Revolution from Mexico to Cuba. Okay. Okay. okay? The yacht's name is Grandma, without a D. Grandma, which is the exact same, uh, is the exact same name as, as a dragon's ship. <laughs> Like that's come on, that's not like that. He didn't just see that and was like, because like you have to be like really invested. You have to be a weeb for communism to like put that in there. I think he's just a weeb for history, honestly. Like yeah, with with the amount of law that One Piece has, mm. the, like One Piece has some of the most intricate world building in, in yeah. my opinion, any piece of media. Oh, absolutely. Like yeah. it's it's obviously one of the most intricate worlds in anime and manga, mm. but I think it's up there with like some of the best worlds that have been in any like book, movie or TV series, yeah. right? And you, you can't do that without doing a fuck ton of history on just, the history of the world, yeah, and yeah. being for sure, uh, being inspired by a lot of events that might have taken place uh, in real world history. I'm just saying, it points too many fingers in one direction. <laughs> oh, here's a uh, here's a photo from Oda's office space where he has like uh, his airsoft guns and then like a photo of Che Guevara right there. I'm just oh saying, God. dude, he's he's come prepared. <laughs> like, I, do, I, have, I have the receipts. If you want he's to see, there you go. <laughs> oh, oh, okay, okay I'm, uh, I mean, airsoft's pretty popular in Japan. Yeah, yeah. Are oh, you still giving her the benefit of the doubt? Yeah. Like, it's like he's just really into airsoft. That's it's all. really popular here. I mean, it's true. It's true. Yeah. yeah. Well, anyway, so that's that's definitely that's definitely a spicy one because like <laughs> a lot of people watch anime and like don't really think about like who's making it or how they're making it or mm, what yeah. they yeah. intend to do with their art. So like, I know a well, lot of people will watch that and still be like, "Yo, fuck that." That's well, not I the think case. A lot of people view anime as being almost uh, non-political. Yeah, uh, an it, escape from. Yeah. Yeah. yeah.